Now we have a little special treat. We have Chef Keith West with us from Puckett's, and he's going to tell us more about what you can chow down on to ring in the new yeah. year. And also with us today, we have Jimmy Simpson. He's the master distiller of Short Mountain Shine. This is moonshine. It's the real deal. It's the real deal. It is the real deal. 105 proof. We'll get to that in a minute. But first of all, Chef, tell us what we can expect on the menu if we're coming down to celebrate with well, Kelly, we've really put a great menu together. On these special events, we try to do something a little bit different than our normal menu. Mm -hmm. um, we feature two of them today. There'll be four choices you can have. There'll also be a uh, stuffed trout and then a vegetarian option. But we've, today we've got the chicken salt and buca. It's got a little Benton's local here in Tennessee, mm -hmm. uh, country ham wrapped around it. It's stuffed with a Gouda cheese. Uh, we've got some smoked grits and a little bit of uh, flat iron green beans there oh, to top yum. it off. We have just a light cream sauce on top to uh, give it just a little bit of more flavor. And then this is my favorite right here, guys. It's, um, it's the braised short ribs. We take uh, Coca-Cola and embraise them. We do them uh, anywhere from six to eight hours, let it reduce down. Oh, wow. um, it's just a great fall apart meat flavor. And we got those on some um, Yukon Gold mashed potatoes, a little bit of fresh onion strings right there, and then um, some grilled asparagus with that. You know what I love? It's comfort food, but it's comfort food taken up a notch. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> it's really nice comfort food. I think food. we got the studio smelling real well here it today. It smells but, pretty good. Um, along with that, each table is going to get if they'd like a little bit of Hoppin' John for nice. good luck, we're going to send you on into the new year with some uh, great luck to get you started. And then this is one of our dessert options here. We've got some, we take uh, our blackberries and we soak them in the uh, short mountain moonshine for one day. And then we make our uh, homemade cobbler out of that like we do here in the restaurant. Um, we'll also have an additional um, dessert option. It'll be a fried goo goo sundae that we featured for their 100 year anniversary. Too. I have so. to have a little sample of both of those, I think, before I can decide. Now, exactly. Jimmy, tell me more about the short mountain shine because this is a local product made in Woodbury, Tennessee. Tennessee, and you guys have been doing this since March? Since is that right? March. Okay. Uh -huh. So, how long does it take to put out a bottle of this? Well, it takes about a week for your fermentation process to complete, mm -hmm. and it takes about a day to cook it. So, you're looking in the neighborhood of about a week. Now, I understand that this is, it's strong because it's the real yes, deal, but yeah. I've also heard it's very, very smooth. It how is. do you get it to that texture? How do you get it so it doesn't completely knock you out? Oh, uh, well, a lot of it has to do with the cooking process. And, and that's a lot your of it secret. has to do with the ingredients too. Right. And yeah. We handpick all of our grains. Of course, we grow our own corn, and we have a mountain spring that we get our water from. And a lot of people says that's where the, a lot of the taste comes from. But we well, have to cook it real slow. And mm -hmm. uh, there's three of us that do that, and we're kind of like three old cooks in the kitchen. We're pretty particular <laughs> about all we do. I love that. So. I love it. Well, thank you so much for coming in and thank showing you. us that. Of course, if you would like to celebrate in style with Puckets, you can do that. It's coming up the New Year's Eve party, 500 Church Street. Dinner is at 9. Tennessee Mafia Jug Band is going to be playing there. Great music for you at 10 o'clock. You said instead of doing the champagne celebration, there's an option. They do have an option. They can get a nice shot of the uh, local moonshine. So you can mountain. either exactly. <laughs> ring in the new year with either champagne or a little shot of shine. Either way, it's going to be a great 2013. If you need more details, you can always go to our website, fox17.com. Thanks for coming in, guys. Thanks, Kelly. Thank you. Thank you.